Hey there, Scanner Danner. This is Scott Brown with IATN, and uh, thanks for doing that uh, that cool little video there. Uh, this is just a video response uh, to give you and your viewers um, a couple of tips on using IATN and mainly the Waveform Image Library. So as you're scrolling through the library and you come across something that's interesting, uh, and you click through to take a look at the uh, the detailed view, oftentimes you may not see all of the uh, you know the resolution that you'd like to see and you can click one two or three times through this to go to full screen one more time finally that takes me to full screen but uh, what you can do instead of doing that is we'll go back to the uh, original view single click right here on this little icon that that will take you right to the full screen view that uh, supports your current browser and if it's even larger than your browser, then you've got this little plus symbol you can click through and, and look at it further, and you can actually read all the text and, and so on. Uh, the second tip, anytime you come across something interesting, uh, you might want to consider saving it to your personal database, my IATN here. And to do so, you just click, click uh, Save, type in a tag word. Uh, you have to have at least one tag word or keyword, something that was useful for you. So in this case, I'll type in CKP. Um, go to the next one, CMP, and, and so on. You can add some notes and then just click Save. So now that instantly gets stored in your My IETN area. And you'll see the latest item here at the top. But if you want to find this stuff later on, you come to your Tags link and just type in one of your terms, your keywords, uh, CKP, and that will set up an instant filter for your CKP saved items in your database. So you have a quick... Uh, quick reference to, to these items here. So anyhow, uh, thanks for the video and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thanks.